and Janelle, and for this week's video, I decided to show you guys my everyday makeup routine for the winter time, and I decided to throw in, like, some holiday-themed makeup, so, like, this Too Faced set. So, I hope you guys enjoy this video, and let's get into it. So, I always start off my makeup routine with a lip balm, so today I'm just using this Nivea Kiss of Vitamin Swirl Lip Balm, and it's actually really cool. It's, like, this, like, swirly design, but... Yeah, I'm just going to use this. And then before I start anything, I like to use my Wet n Wild Photo Focus Eyeshadow Primer. We're going in with this Maybelline Cover Stick Correcting Concealer. This is a yellow shade and this helps with your under eyes. I'm just going to be taking my Real Techniques blending sponge and just blending that in. To hide the yellowness, I'm just going to be taking my Maybelline Instant Age Run Concealer in the shade Light Pale and just putting that under my eyes. And then I'm also going to be using this like as a highlight shade. Next, I'm just going to be taking my Maybelline Fit Me Set and Smooth Powder in the shade 130 Buff Beige. And then I'm just going to be taking this e.l.f. blending brush and just applying this all over my face. So for this look, since it is more of a wintry look, I decided that I'm going to be using my Too Faced Grand Hotel Cafe set. The first thing I'm going to be using is the Peppermint Mocha Palette, and I'm just going to take this blush in the shade Santa Baby, and then I'm taking my Real Techniques blush brush and just putting on this blush, and it is very pigmented, so you have to be careful. And next, I'm taking the Gingerbread Cookie Palette and the bronzer in the shade Gingerbread, and then I'm just taking this brush, I'm not really sure what it's called, and just putting on some bronzer. Moving on to highlight, I'm going to be taking my Anastasia Beverly Hills Glow Kit in the shade Sun Dip, and then I'm taking this e.l.f. highlighting brush, and... In this palette, I'm going to be taking the Summer Shade and also the Moonstone Shade and just kind of mixing those together and using them as a highlight. Next, moving on to the eyes, I'm going to be taking the Gingerbread Cookie Palette again and I'm just going to be taking this flat eyeshadow brush from e.l.f. and I'm going to be putting the shade Ginger Cream all over my lid. Next, I'm going to be taking this small blending brush from e.l.f. and then I'm going to be taking the shade Maple Syrup and putting that in my crease. And I'm also going to be working it into like the outer edge of my eyes. I'm just going to be taking a bigger blending brush and just blending it out. Next, I'm going to be taking the same small blending brush and the shade Cup of Joe right here. And then just adding that to like the outer V and like to darken up the crease. Next, I'm going to be taking this flat eyeshadow brush from Wet n Wild in the shade Ginger Snap and putting that like on the inner edge of my lid and kind of blending it out. And I'm also going to wet my brush just for like a bolder effect. Okay, so for this shade, it isn't as bold as I wanted, so I'm just going to go in with my finger and just put it on like that. Going to be blending it out. And then I'm just going to be taking this smaller brush and then just taking that gold shade gingerbread and just kind of putting it along the lower lash line. 
And I also just want to say that I, like, honestly have no clue what I'm doing. I just put on some eyeshadow and go with it. So I like the way this looks. Next, I'm just going to take the concealer again and then just put a little dot, like, over here just to kind of clean it up. Next, I'm going to be taking the Too Faced Better Than Sex Mascara in like this sample size. And this also came in the kit with the three eyeshadow palettes. So I'm just going to be applying these to my lashes. For the lips, I'm going to be trying like an ombre lip look. So first, I'm going to be taking this Revlon Ultra HD Matte Lip Color Love Amore, I'm pretty sure. So I'm just going to be taking this and putting it towards like the outer edges of my lips. And next, I'm just going to take the NYX Liquid Suede in the shade Tea and Cookies. And then I'm just going to put this more towards the, like, inner corners of my lips. And now, last but not least, to finish off this makeup look, I'm just going to be taking the Urban Decay All Nighter Makeup Setting Spray just to set my makeup. So this is the finished look. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below and I will see you guys next week with a new video. Bye!